What's up, YouTube? Janish is back. Part three. Nirvana Initiative. I keep wanting to say Institute. I don't know why. Me too. I don't know why. <laughs> it just sounds more natural. Um, where we last left off. <laughs> well, you guys watched part two. You remember. We, we gotta go with, through it again. Yeah, don't have us tell you. Yeah, yeah, you tell you know us. From watching. You tell <laughs> you. Please tell us. All right, uh, playtime. Yeah. Two hours, 28 minutes. How's that possible? How, how did it oh, take I'm me 20 minutes? Saw the... What? How did, it, how did it save 20 minutes later? <laughs> what? I don't... <laughs> sure. Did we do anything? We went to into the uh, the bonus room to look at the costumes and shit. But other than that, we didn't go Ryuki back. is supposed to be here? You were in charge of the HP. I like this better. Oh, yeah. Ryuki's memories may hold the answer. Mizuki. Because in the last one, they just said, the here's, here's the pictures. Do you remember? <laughs> Yeah, in, in, in the last one they said so nothing. Right. Mind. I mean, I'm gonna skip it. <laughs> cause we remember. That's right. We remember. Yeah, that's right. Cause we were in we were in Ryuki Somnium last time. Yeah, and now we're playing as Ryuki in the past, uh, talking to not Date. I don't care what they say. That's not Date. Mhm. Mm so now we gotta use the map to go to. See Ota. All right, where do you wanna go first? Ota's, Iris, uh, the Kumakura office, and then I forgot who the fuck was there. I feel like we should save that guy for last. That that's that's blockhead. That that's Steve. This okay. All right. So yeah. Let's go down the list then. Yeah. Let's go down the list. Um, I also wanted to say I forgot to mention the last part. I do like how boss's office is still overly festive, but it looks cleaner. Mm. I like it. it. Looks to me, it looks better. Is that a limo? He drives in the back of. A oh, he's a rich boy. I forgot. That's a nice added touch. I like that. Who the fuck is that? His. Love. That's the guy with the keyblade. Wait, is, is the diner open now? Yeah, what the fuck? Man, this sucks. I already talked my jaw off yesterday. That was with the local detective, right? I haven't heard anything yet. Big sis, perhaps you should help them. Big sis? Who the fuck are you? Big sis? Ah, that's just what I call Mizuki. Yeah, but who the fuck are you? Hold on, let me... Why is she your big sis? Let me hide the Elgato a little bit. Ah, okay, there we go. And you're... My name is Kizuna. It's a pleasure to meet you. That was weird. Why did why, why <laughs> you say it like that? My name is My name Kizuna. is Kizuna. <laughs> Hi, I'm from the Metropolitan Police Department. Ryuki, right? Shut you up. You were no. on a quiz show Ryuki. last night. <laughs> Who the fuck are you? Yeah. I am indeed. How did you know? Are you guys in a sorority? Why did you call her Your big sis? uniform? Don't tell me you're a uniform buff, Ryuki. Why are you making those eyes, you I weirdo? I didn't take Yo, you bro, from her. Wait. Bird. Oh, bro, o Ota stays making the weirdest faces in this game. Bro, Ota, you are still 24 in this. Why do you have another high school hanging out with you? Our favorite game we played in the past year. That's a That's loaded tough question. Because we, man, I gotta I gotta look back at some of our uh, playlists because like there was one where we were like, I don't know, I don't know if it was. I don't know if it was Dongan. I think there was something around Dongan. Bro, it was Lake. Lake there was, was something around Dongan that I liked a lot. <laughs> it was Lake. Yeah, Lake was it great. Was Lake. Um, yeah. Well, I think the conversation starts and ends with Chinatown. We'll do a yearly review at the end of the year of like what was our mm -hmm. favorite for the last year. Because uh, it's been a, a long year of doing a lot of shit. So, I don't know. That That's tough to think about. But, Somnium Files is definitely up there. Uh, yeah. Fuck, we played so much shit that I kind of don't remember everything. It's tough. Yeah, the first song was great. Hopefully this one's going to be really good, too. Because yeah. <sighs> he is good friends with Iris and Mame, too. Who the fuck is Mame? Oh, you don't know about Mame, do you? Come on, man. It's only been like... Mama, <laughs> Moma, Ma, Mommy. <laughs> <laughs> Mammy. <laughs> Mommy. Arceus! Oh my god, I forgot about Arceus. Oh, oh Arceus shit. is great. Arceus yeah. is great. Fuck, bro, I forgot that. <laughs> but then we still have Scarlet and Violet, so that might also... Oh, you know what's crazy? I keep telling myself I'm gonna finish Arceus when we are when we have free time. <laughs> that, that, that's not happening. Oh, Holy shit. Her full name. I'm finishing Arceus the week GTA 6 comes out next year. <laughs> Uh, Mame Due? She attends Sekiba High like Kizzy and Iris. Who the fuck is Kizzy? 
Oh, this is Kizzy. <laughs> Iris and Mame belong to the same oh. dance club as I. It was through them that I was introduced to Big Sis. Like, yes, I most certainly do. However, I am not very. How are you introducing it. eight new characters when we're <laughs> when we're two days after when the last game left off? Who the fuck and are you? <laughs> and four of them are like different spellings of mom. That's not true. You've even won a dancing competition before. That was nothing more than a fluke. Iris is a far better dancer. Oh yeah, she gets paid millions of fucking dollars. Yeah. Why do you call Mizuki hmm. that? This is a bit difficult to explain. I just sensed a certain elegance to Mizuki that was characteristic of an older sister. It is that Are you gonna tell us this whole time someone else that's not Mizuki, that's a older woman inside Mizuki's body? We brain swapped <laughs> her when she was a baby. Tama, how old is Kizuna? Eighteen, same as Iris. They're in their third year, so they're Do they all get left soon. back. In other words, <laughs> Mizuki is a whole six years younger than Kizuna. Yes, I know how to yes, I knew the math. I was watching that quiz show live as well. Then goodness, I couldn't believe it. That corpse I thought she said thank goodness. On the screen. <laughs> I couldn't sleep last night from the I was worried about Big Sis. Of yeah, you called me a bunch, I remember. You witnessed the corpse with your own eyes, did you not? Are you certain you're okay? I'm totally fine. Your mental fortitude is admirable. I've been through a lot is all. Kazuna Ch Damn, he's less descriptive than fucking Date. <laughs> what the incident that was last night? crazy. I said it before, but I was watching that stream live. I heard Tessa and Mizuki were gonna be on that show, right? Yeah, you fucking then pervert. That body appeared out of nowhere. Let the body in. Man, I couldn't believe what I saw. Speaking of crazy, you saw it. No, not the whole thing. Too scary. Too I scary. saw the one before, though. The one before? You Four? don't know? I think it was about half a year ago. So when we were working on the a video similar to that one went viral. Ah, I know of that one as no. well. No, no, no. <laughs> the mysterious video known as Bats 490, correct? Yup. There was some kind of code hidden in it too. According to the rumors, whoever deciphers it will learn the secret of the world. Bats 490. I'm travel. The secret of the world? Did a grade schooler come up with that or something? You're a grade schooler yourself, by the way. Stay hydrated. The video starts with a bunch of bats flying around. Mm. Bruce Wayne. Yes, Got that's it. where the bats <laughs> part comes there from. There was 490 bats in there. I don't know what that? the 490 means, though. Were you able to decode it? No way. I had no idea what it meant. Well, it's not like solving it would have been a big deal. I'll bet that secret of the world stuff is bogus anyway. Don't ruin the fantasy, Mizuki. I'm just telling it like it is. It's just an ARG. It's a game for kids. ARG means yeah, yeah, alternate yeah, yeah, game yeah, maps. Players decode the information. Simply put, an ARG is a fusion of games and real life. Yeah. Oh my god, trivia over that? The goal of an ARG varies. If someone beats it, they might get a prize, but most times it's just a prank. Oftentimes the main objective is simply to solve the mystery. Sometimes they're even used as a marketing tool. ARG are progressed by an unidentified number of players working together mainly online. Due to this, it has high potential to spread fast. It makes it very helpful when marketing content. Which is what they did for this fucking game. Are you Mr. <laughs> Otamatsushita? Oh, you did you talk to Date or something? Yeah, something like that. What do you mean by that? He's linked to the new Cyclops serial killings. That's how I know. Oh, his name Ota and age. Is 24. Yeah, that's why I'm being polite. You're respecting your elder? Nah. Ota handles the cooking, serving, and accounting all by himself. So they open wow. the Wow. That's right. So they open Tama, the restaurant? Are there any legal issues with this? Not at all. His mother, Mayumi Matsushita, holds the proper certification for food hygiene. Mr. Matsushita, can I ask where your mother is? Probably in the living room back there. I guess she's sitting at the Kotatsu watching TV or something. Sitting at a Kotatsu? It recently reopened. They get decent customer oh. traffic and make a pretty good amount of money. Bro, how did it recently reopen when at the end of yeah. the game, it wasn't open? Do you have a Came girlfriend? Of, nowhere. of course I have one. You met her yesterday, right? Tess. Oh. No, this is alternate reality. Ota, do you this is alternate reality. Out? There's no way. <laughs> oh, well, as long as we're on the subject. Are you going oh. out with anyone, Kizzy? 
Oh, Ooh, me? My man trying to shoot Such his shot. Such relations with gentlemen are completely foreign to me. Are you into baby face guys that know how to cook? Uh, oh, you have a girlfriend, my bro. My type is so stereotypical that I am embarrassed to admit it. Someone like Prince. A prince? Like Prince. I, I hope my Prince Charming <laughs> will appear before that's why, me with the That's why I skipped the dialogue. Like... That's my dream. Shut Glass. the fuck up. No! Slipper? Oh! I was actually gonna talk to him next. Ota? Who is that? Well, he's a customer. He comes by a lot. Yeah, I wanted to talk to him um, next after the- Well, in any case, I have a great- I have a feeling she's gonna shoes. get split in half. My admiration of yeah, Princess Cinderella that. partially comes from that, I'm sure. Pause. Glass slippers. Isn't that so magical? How lovely it would be to dance in them. Wouldn't it be hard to dance in glass slippers? <laughs> that is true. Shut up. Okay. I did want to talk to him next. It's all right now because I am here. How are you, young boy? <clears throat> is he? Yes, he's not doing too good. What the fuck is going on? <laughs> Maybe you shouldn't talk to that guy. He seems pretty drunk. He's drinking non-alcoholic beer. What do you want? Jerk. Was this just say damage land? Not aware what? you could get drunk from non-alcoholic <laughs> beverages. Pardon me, but may I ask your name? Sora. There's no response. He seems to be depressed. He seems to be a regular here. Is he depressed or a regular or both? Put him in the sink. <laughs> He's cooking food in the kitchen. Wow, you're just. <laughs> Why Iris were you on the show last night? Here on the show, so she was asked to bring another talent from no one could yeah. make it. So I decided to go instead. Oh, by the way, she's the CEO of Lemniscate now. What? Yeah. Oh, because Renju's dead. Yeah. So she owns. Lemniscate. As the president of Lemniscate, yeah. I couldn't just turn it down. President? Aren't you twelve? Yeah, but my mom and dad. But you're the daughter. Story. Yeah. I ended up taking over the company after Daddy. Hmm. <laughs> what did I just skip? Oh, okay. Never mind. My bad. I thought it. Shouldn't well, you be in school? Today is February 11th. My parents National are dead. Day. <laughs> oh, yeah. I, I'm so, grieving. Why are you here? Why else? To eat some of Ota's cooking. I brought my friend Kizzy with me. And I appreciate your business. Why is Mizuki blushing? Huh. I don't know. And. Is she I mean, drunk? Mr. Date is like your foster father. So, I thought I'd let you know, just in case. Foster father? I'm the one <laughs> taking care of him. I'm paying the rent, and utility bills too. I mean, it makes sense. Oh, I know of Mr. Mm -hmm. Date as well. He is quite close with Iris. So, I have the honor of being on friendly terms with him Why do they well. say it like that? I don't like that. Any Sorry, clues? but I don't know anything. I just went on the show like Iris at, and then a body showed up out of nowhere. A I've body. heard about Jin Furoe. <laughs> <clears throat> it's not like I knew him personally. Sorry, I can't really help. No, there's something, there's something fucky going on, bro. Hey, there Kizzy, is. I want to see you dance. Where did this come from? I want to see too. No, Don't you're you want to see too, Ryuki? <laughs> oh, uh, I want to see you too. Yeah. No, Everybody like a snake, this. ma. Then I'll play some music. Just a sec. Copyright Wait, strike. Um, I have not agreed to anything yet. Bro. He's gonna play the brand new Drake album. <laughs> the fuck is this? Take your bag off when you're dancing. <laughs> Stupid. I hope the guy gets up and <laughs> just <laughs> splits her in half. <laughs> you heard what she said? <laughs> you notice in the bathroom? Yo, this... Yo, this is kind of a bop. Bro, yo... <laughs> this is so much better than the other song. <laughs> it is. I'm eating donuts in the bathroom. That sounds like some regular, like, emo indie band, like... <laughs> Mid-2000s shit. This is a Fall Out Boy song. We're about to go to Emo Night and play this shit, bro. <laughs> oh shit! The key change though, okay? Yeah, I'm feeling that. What? That's me. <laughs> 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 
<laughs> Wait, you, I'm, I'm, I'm only, only half. half. See, see, now we're paying attention. Now we're paying attention. And she has a heart bag? What's going on here? A heart bag, okay. What's going on oh, here? That's incredible. And it's shaped like an actual heart. Alright, let me just say I'm a big fan of Carly Rae Jepsen in this game, bro. She did a fantastic job. <laughs> <laughs> Definitely better than Re Invincible Rainbow Arrow, but we know from know Rainbow Invincible name. fucking Arrow. You're Kizuna, aren't you? Hold on, bro. Stop. Uh, I'm, talking. I'm talking. I'm talking. Yourself earlier. Shut up, fucking Akuma. My name is Lian. Lian Twining. And I'm 22 Lian years old. What's his name? Ian? He's 22. American, and my mother's Japanese. So, Logan Kizuna, Paul. I want you to marry me. Bro, what? bro, you are not 22, bro. If he's 22, I'm fucking 50. Bro, you saw Ota's face? <laughs> no, I missed it. Okay, hold up. So what? I, so what I was gonna say is like, we know that song in the last game had some hints to the fucking truth of what's going on. So the whole, maybe there is something going on with combining the bodies. I don't know. Yeah. I mean that's the biggest takeaway for me from this. Mm -hmm. Um. Let's get the reaction of the room. Okay, never mind. We can't. There's nothing anybody else has to say. They're all speechless. Hey, uh, Kizzy. Why would you... It let me click Bro, on that... her and it just said fucking her name. Is that song on Spotify? It could be. Uh, are you okay? No, I'm not okay. My heart feels like a jackhammer. Oh, it like says damage zone on his chest. chest. Any second. With oh. an airplane? Of course this isn't a joke. Is that a cross He's or an airplane? <laughs> purified my heart. There the is plane. so much darkness building inside me. But she cleared it all Bro, away. I'm telling you, there's some Kingdom Hearts shit going on in this game right now. Heaven. I've always wanted to be a pilot since I was little. It was my dream to That's fly it. So it is an airplane. Yeah. Kizuna made that dream come true from seeing her dance. It was like my soul pierced the So this is what they think an American guy looks like? So I guess I've so. Decided. I'm gonna marry her. Won't you marry me, Kizuna? No, thank you. <laughs> I'll pretend I didn't hear that. No, thank you. I'll pretend I didn't hear that either. No, thank you. Anyway, Yo, I won't shit. give up. <laughs> You'll come around eventually, Kizuna. My motto is, if at first you don't succeed, try and fail again. I think you mean try, try again. Well, actually, here? I got fired yesterday. I didn't feel like doing anything after I woke up this morning. I came here so I could drink my problems away. But... You were drinking non-alcoholic beer. Bro, even Ota said that his shit. Off of them, okay? This is a worse version of Ota. From? I was a bank clerk. What were you really? I don't like. Okay, so the full soundtrack it, is on Spotify. I, I can't find the song. <laughs> I was looking for Kizuna. Huh. Uh. Bro, look. The name of this song is wild. Seven nine six F seven five six B six E six F. It just keeps going, bro. What? Hold on. Other way. Wait. <laughs> Other way. That long ass name? Oh, oh wait. That's what the fuck? Is. That's gotta be that. that's gotta be a code that we're not gonna decipher because it's gonna not, spoil I'm the whole fucking game. It's gonna I've seen no spoilers so far, mm. but I can't find the name. How many songs are on that album? Like 40? 68. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sure some of those are gonna just be like themed like the music yeah, in yeah, the background course, right yeah. now. It's like Persona was like that too with their I soundtrack. Think that is a yeah. noble job. You're so right! He's a janitor. Well, he was a janitor. My job was taken from me. I have zero motivation to do anything now. Hard work just seems so pointless. Half I dislike to people hold. who don't work hard. Is that one of the titles? All right. I think that's the name I'm of the song that. I'm the employment office tomorrow. She sings. This guy has a rather one-track mind. He doesn't seem all that bad, though. No, he's fucking weird. What do you mean he doesn't seem all that bad? He's weird. Don't don't encourage now, this. No, we haven't obtained much useful information. There's no point in staying here for- Yeah, let's go somewhere else. Oh, so before we go, I wanted to look at the evaluation page because it said we needed to increase our evaluation to unlock costumes, so I just want to take a look at what the fuck I'm fucking up. I found the song. <laughs> you found the song? On the Spotify? Yeah. No, yeah, it's on Spotify, but it's not on the playlist. Let me see okay. if it's the same song. Yes. Okay. I'm gonna bop this on the way to work today. I'm so pumped. <laughs> All right, so there you go. New song. New song just dropped. 
All right, so now we're going to go see Iris and more pedophiles at the school hanging out. Yeah. Yo, Palix is going to be in shambles. That song was actually really good. Yeah, Palix, I'm <laughs> sorry, bro. We actually like this one. You should have recommended it. The mermaid girl was a high school student this whole time? Oh, my God. Well, th that is true, right? They were classmates, no? I thought they were just co-workers. How are you feeling? Still upset about last night? I'm okay. Bro, this is this is the Dungan Rumpa room. See? I'm bouncing. The Dungan Rumpa room. What if a fucking uh bouncy, bouncy, what's his bouncy. face? Mama Monokuma is gonna pop up on the TV. Later. Hey. By the way, hey, yo. She's one of my best friends. That's Mame? Why do we now know her name? My name is Mame Doi. I'm a third year at Sekiba High. Why are we just finding out her name now? I'm a super hyper cutie miracle beauty. Yo, can we kill her? I think we should leave. Uh, let's Hold kill her on. with her x-ray powers. So you're the one I heard about. Mizuki and Kizuna told me about you earlier. Huh. You just pictured me in a leotard, didn't you? What? Uh, She's a no. freak, bro. Oh, if I wanted to do that, Somebody call the police. I'll go visit the fucking trident in some police. fish pocket. Oh, come to think of it. You were on the quiz show last night, weren't you? You're yeah. Mr. Rero 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 Taro, was it? It's Ryuki! What? I see. Mr. Ryuki Rero Taro. That, that gotta be a weird joke over there. What? Yeah. Why was it moving like that? Ryuki's gonna try. No way they're gonna let us x ray her again. Did we do it last time? I think so. Whoa. A mommy turned into a skeleton. It's an x ray. I know about the incident. I was watching the live stream of that. So question. weird. <laughs> What's your career Wait, did we have to like interact with her when she was being extra? No, it just, just automatically did that. Home, so oh. money's tight. I don't have time to go to college or a specialty school. You work at Sunfish Mommy Pocket. Is so smart. She always has the best grades, even though she doesn't go to class much. I've been busy with my part job and dance practice. Where do you work? Sunfish Pocket. I work as a mermaid at a gaudy maid cafe called Sunfish Pocket. Yeah. Mermaids are what they call the maids. Yeah, yeah, they yeah. wear these cute mermaid outfits as they said yeah, yeah, I yeah. know because I used to work as mommy works there at night after dance practice. We saw you at day. <laughs> mm -hmm. Don't tell anyone, but until about 11. Even when you were 17. Yes, ever since I was 16. That's a violation of Article that 61, is. though mm -hmm. it would be the employer who would be penalized. I lied to the manager about my age. Okay. That's a bit. Oh, she said she was 20? Sorry, I'm sorry. Mm -hmm. Don't arrest me. Labor Standard Law, Article 61, declares you cannot employ anyone younger than 18 for the night shift. Vajin Fury. I don't think there's anyone from our generation that doesn't know who he is. He's famous for having a sharp tongue. He used to use to start up stupid what? internet sorry, drama crap on Twitter too. Mommy Bro, this is is this is literally Elon song. Musk. <laughs> His main job was being the CEO of Music Food. I guess that's like the that's the worst logo I've ever seen. I think oh, oh, almost almost as bad as the name. When he was 22, <laughs> but his history before then is shrouded in mystery, and no one knows anything I thought he was about the CEO his childhood. Of an IT company. Right? Me yeah. too. He was a pretty mysterious figure. If his IT company's called Music Food, it's a subscription it music service. So Spotify mainly focuses on Japanese music. Why did I say it like that? So it's not a widely known service worldwide, <laughs> but they do have 10 million subscribers. So I'm sure they make a good profit. They charge one yen. <laughs> <laughs> is class over? Don't you know today is February? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I forget, yeah, yeah. Then so why are you here? Are you at school? Dance practice. Well, how do I put this? I can only wear this uniform and attend this school for about another month or so. So I invited Mame, and we just kind of ended up here. Iris and Mame are third years. They'll be graduating. So they were feeling like nostalgic or whatever. Okay. I guess. Clickety clack, clickety clack. I boiled a potato and my socks in a sack. Mr. Ryuki, are you That's okay? terrible. <laughs> what? What? <laughs> New folk anthem? Listen to Ryuki's weird song. No idea where he got it from. The song Ryuki <laughs> was singing was German soup socks, I think. Yo, Palix, you gotta come explain this shit, bro. What do you mean German yeah, soup Palix. socks? Mm -hmm. Mizuki didn't tell you? She did. 
but I want to double check. What did I ask? <laughs> in the agency I belong to, Lemniscape, received a request for me to appear. Oh, at the, sh at the show, okay. Well, we couldn't bring right, anyone, right. and that's why Mizuki... Yeah, gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. I'm sorry, I don't know anything about it. It did feel like some sort of paranormal phenomenon, Here though. she go again. Paranormal. Like I mentioned last night, maybe that body to the other yeah, half could have been absorbed into some other dimension. And that split the body in two. Mm -hmm. How many times are we going to see this? Speaking of which... There are rumors that people who watched that video and disappeared could have also been swallowed into another dimension. Iris is sitting on a chair. Leering at an 18-year-old. That's a bit creepy, don't you think? I was not leering. I... Whoa. <laughs> I was like, what? <laughs> that QR code video, a similar video went viral about half a year ago. Okay, does somebody have it? Supposedly people who saw the bat 49. 490, whatever. That's 490. So, they say those who went missing were taken into another dimension. Yes, <gasps> so did I. But you two haven't disappeared. Unless we're in that dimension right now. Ooh. That's because we haven't decoded it. Never mind. There's a code <laughs> hidden inside Bats 490. They say the code reveals a specific location. Seven, six, five, nine, 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 Who's joining? Oh, this scary Jimmy, fucking guy. I told you to wait for me at the gate, didn't I? Yeah, but I got here a bit early. Okay, thank His God. He sounds Ishida. regular. Sounds normal. He's the owner <laughs> of the future. <laughs> <Star Ramen. laughs> sound like the no, fucking Texas Chainsaw sure Massacre. You know <laughs> yeah, I've been there many times. But why is Gen here? Ah, if it isn't Mr. Ryuki. Bro, don't talk to me like you're regular, bro. What's wrong with you? By any chance? Yes. I was talking to Iris about it. I also watched the quiz show last night. Several people I know were on it. What kind of pants are those? <laughs> we're talking to the unicorn. <laughs> oh, <laughs> are you asking because I'm wearing this mask? It was fine. The security for this school is practically non-existent. That's there are terrible. Tons of places on the grounds without any fences or security cameras. What? So you didn't walk in through the front? Why do you say like that? I couldn't have dressed like this. A guard would have stopped. So then, me. why are you dressed like this? There's a reason he always yeah. wears the mask. He would scare people if he took it off. I haven't seen him without his mask myself, but that's what he said. Supposedly, it's something he was born with. He got called a monster when he was a kid. Bro, this is not better. This is worse. This is worse. Why are you here? I drove here to pick up Amame and Iris. I need them to help out at work tonight. Oh, I'm sorry, Genny. Something came up. You fucking bum. Uh, oh, I see. I'm free, though. I can still help. I'm trying to navigate this great. conversation. You two are close with Gen, <laughs> huh? Here we go. Yeah, we're just a big old happy threesome. That was a weird way to say yeah, it. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Well, Mame visited Brahmin a lot, even back when it was in Yotsuya. Once it moved to Golden Yokocho, I took Iris there. Yeah, it must have moved there in one day Mr. because. Ricky? Of course, I've been there several times. Mr. Date took me there. When? When, bro? Mr. Yeah, when? Date? When? So you must know Mr. Date too, Kenny. I've known him for a long time. No, you haven't. We're so close. We've seen each other's buttholes. Huh? What? Wow. <laughs> what, a what a small world. world. <laughs> Is she really going to ignore the buttholes? There's no way. I didn't see his butthole in the last game. What are we talking about? Who are you, yeah. bro? Show yourself. <laughs> yeah, also, which which butthole? The Dante one or the Saito one? True. Is Jen... Is, uh, the owner of the, you're right, yeah, okay. You're more than welcome to visit any time. We visit Whoa. all the time, apparently. It's amazing. Everything he makes is so good. My tongue could fall right off. Personally, I think his place and Matsushita Diner are competing for the number one spot. I don't know if that's Come bad for now. him. Don't compare my restaurant. Yeah, exactly. Like I was just about to say, imagine saying a restaurant's as good as a diner. <laughs> It's as good as uh, the fucking unicorn. The cooking there was that the explains the. <laughs> was still the man behind the chef's knife. That's actually Mike. Damn, bro. You see, you see what he just said? He just said the place was better when Takoro was there, but now that it's the woman with dementia and Ota, that place sucks. 
Can you believe before that? His dad died. Fuck Gen. Damn. Gen is canceled. But now it's his son Ota running things. Damn. He doesn't know the first thing about cooking. He only knows these how to oogle at girls. Important condiment. Yeah. What's the most important condiment? You can do something weird, bro. What? MSG. Well, I think we got enough okay. info here. What's for the now? most important condiment? Ryuki, wanna get going? Sounds good. Bro, what is it? <laughs> no, I'm not. No, nah, y'all are weird. That's the secret of the world, bro. That's what we're gonna find out when we decode Bats 490. He has a bad face. Bro, if you're gonna tell me he's the killer, like, yeah, no shit. <laughs> like, <laughs> yeah, so obvious. The guy that's in the big white outfit and the mask. Like, come on. Uh, let's go see our other mom character. What the fuck? Wait, you're the director of that quiz show, Chimpe? You got a problem with that? But you were on no, the show. But I told you he got out. He's making an honest living as a civilian these days. Ain't that right? That's right, boss. So where's the doc? You're not a member of the gang anymore. Can we x-ray this? Okay. Can we something about the dragon ball? A dragon again? with a gold ball. <clears throat> kind of like us, Ryuki. Hmm. You're not made of gold though. Okay. Sorry. <clears throat> Why are you on the show? About that. He knows all about it. I'm pissed about the case too. Cause that he scared Tessa. That appearance was like a dream come true. The whole show was ruined. I'd love to get my hands on the bastard responsible. A dream come true? So, in the goodbye sequence in the last game, he mm -hmm. he faints cause uh, Tessa shakes his hand or some shit. I don't know. They do a whole. He has the whole gang do like a set you bet shit. He faints, and then when we're gonna leave, Momo's like, uh, Date, I want to do puff puff. And I'm thinking, like, what the fuck is he talking about? I thought he wanted her to fart on his face. That's what I thought he was talking <laughs> about. He wanted to motorboat her. So Date tells him, close his eyes. He takes this guy who fainted, puts him on the fucking desk, and he motorboats his fucking chest. The boss and Tessa got <laughs> That is an insane yeah. sequence. But I'm sure that doesn't happen in this fucking reality, so I don't know. Shut it. Anyway, I'd love to help you with your investigation and all, but unfortunately, I don't have any info that might be useful to you. I was gonna say something like, what if we're living out a route that's not the final route? Mm -hmm. But then I was like, wait, we put in the fucking codes for who, who's the oh, killer I don't and know everything. What to tell you. Yeah. Did you see any suspicious people hanging around the studio, for example? Suspicious people? Mm. I guess the only one who comes to mind is Kameji. That's the host? Kameji? You mm -hmm. mean... Yeah, and That's Steve. Kameji, yeah. The host. Yep. Supposedly he has connection to the Yakuza. That guy? I'm not talking about our Ow. group, of course. It's just something I... It looked like he ate the fucking Infinity Cube. Like... Or it is, he's involved in some dangerous transactions. Though that might not have anything to do with last night. Yeah, I didn't take his finger or anything. We're not doing any of that outdated cutting off your finger deal. After all, the Kumakuras are a gang with morals. Sounds yeah, like an morals. oxymoron. Like a vegan zombie. <laughs> morals or morons? All right, the leader of the Kumakuras, Chinpei. Why did you become the director of the show? I to the school to learn about film. I wanted to be a porn director. That actually makes sense. Oh, that makes sense. Yeah. <laughs> Reach out to a production company for online shows. Okay. And I was promoted to director right away. Supposedly. So that was a porn quiz away, show. So Got it. really needed me to take his place. Why was the director didn't one have of the enough group? people. The quiz show needed three teams of two to answer questions. We tried hard, but couldn't get together that last team. I had no choice but to participate myself, so... I invited the boss to go with Yeah, what a great and job Roma at doing the to participate? quiz show. Huh? Well, you know. Because Tessa was there. It was a request from one of my precious underlings. No, it's because Tessa was there. I convinced him by saying Tessa would be there too. Yeah. Then he agreed right away. Yeah, of course. We knew that. My girl is a baby on the way right now. Oh, that's now. nice. So we decided to get married. But her parents wouldn't approve of it. Said they wouldn't let me have their How daughter unless he? I got out of the business. I agonized over the decision. So much that I could only eat two slices of pizza instead of the... What a man has Shut to up. do, what a man has to do. So, I made up my mind to talk to the boss about it. But before I could... Oh, I get it. Then I'll try to 
try asking him for you. <laughs> so that's why he did it? I didn't have any ulterior motives, so don't get it twisted. No, you just did it because she told you to. I came to say yeah. thanks to the boss for yesterday. I was thinking of going to Akiba. And this place is on the way. Why Akiba? Well, um... Why they announce it two different ways? By a maid cafe. <laughs> he said Akiba, he said Akiba. Which one is it, bro? We're being misled. But let us stray. Yeah, it's called Sunfish Pocket. My girlfriend works there. They're all underage, bro. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. Hold up, hold up, Shinpei. Hold on, I'm on your ass, bro. How old are you? We'll it's still wrong. It is wrong. It's still wrong. It's still wrong. It's still wrong. You're not 24, bro. Look at, look at your... You, you grew a horn. You gotta be like 90. There's no way. You're a demon. Yeah. Sorry, but I haven't found anything that might be a lead. What about the rest of the staff? They'll probably tell you the same thing. The detectives from HQ have already questioned the rest of the staff. Their report is uploaded on the database. There are okay. clues. There isn't any information that could... That could help us. What about the other contestants? That show was supposed to run for six hours straight from six to midnight? What kind of game bro, show is that, bro? That's not a show. That's a fucking job. But it wasn't the <laughs> same contestants the whole time. Oh. Okay, they're supposed to swap out every hour. Our appearance was slated for 9 p.m. Didn't know anything about the others. You're the director. I already turned in the list of contestants to the cops. Why don't you try hitting them up one by one? The other detectives already took care of that a while back. Yesterday. No clues there either. So we're wasting our time talking to these fuckos. Okay. Kameji has connections with the Yakuza? Could it be true? Let's figure that out later. You need to gather intel for now. Got it. Then let's go somewhere else. Well, we're gonna go talk to him right now, so that's actually perfect the timing, the way we kind of yeah. broke this list down. A nice, nice segue. <clears throat> let's see. Department store. I don't like this guy. Shoma, my <laughs> little boy, he's in elementary school. Is he doing stand-up comedy? One day I wake up, go to the bathroom mirror, and I have writing on my forehead. It must have been Shoma. He had been learning letters in school recently. Butthead. Anyway, he writes yep. <laughs> Death Tub. And I'm thinking, Death Tub? Is that what he meant? Is he trying to tell me something? Then Shoma saw my face and started busting out laughing and i was thinking what's so funny that's when i realized when you see death tub in the mirror god of energy inti inti pachaka max bro nobody what? wants to see this guy live nobody wants to see this guy a live <laughs> <laughs> No way she found this guy fucking funny. Look at his no butthole mouth. Oh One God. day I got a call from school and a rather heavy set vice principal told me. Your Shoma called me a pig of all things. I apologized, then gave Shoma a talking to. Me. Listen here, Shoma. Don't you ever call the vice principal that again. He said, Okay, I won't call the vice principal a pig anymore, but it's okay if I call a pig vice principal, right? I say, sure, why not? So then as the kid is leaving, he says, I'm sorry, can I go play with my friends now, vice principal? Stupid. God of energy. Oh my god. <laughs> That's how you do a fucking put. Good. Thank god it's over. <laughs> Get her out of my fucking head. No, no wonder why Ryu is a fucking alcoholic. Are you finished? <laughs> well, you're the only you're one here. Only one here. <laughs> you're Shut Mr. Up. Ryuki from the Metropolitan. Yes. yes. Then let's go somewhere else to talk. There's nobody here. We could talk right here. It's quieter, right? Yeah, well, as long as we don't have to hear this fucking carnival ass fucking music. Yeah. I fucking hate him. I hate him. I hate him. Andes? That's his name? Andres? God of energy, Inti, Inti. Pachaka Max. <laughs> Wait, 
The Ferris wheel? It's still just as loud. Well, why not? <laughs> Alone with a middle-aged man in an enclosed space? Yeah, we're gonna space? die, bro. This is not what I had in mind. Are we actually gonna do, like, a full fucking cycle? Why I a Ferris wheel? I love Ferris wheels. I hate you. I like anything <laughs> that continuously spins around, actually. Like a portal? Plane propellers, washing machines, the beds at love hotels. Okay. There used to be rotating beds at love hotels a long time ago. Why is she blushing? <laughs> How do you know that? Just like life, isn't it? With its ups and downs. All the beds at love hotels don't go up and down, though. Although, I guess they do, in a way. A boy is just mm. like me. You know? <laughs> sure. That's a dirty joke. You mentioned the <laughs> stage earlier. Yes. He really loves this Ferris wheel. His too. son is dead. He's almost in middle school, and he still comes here by himself all the nah, time. No, your son is definitely dead. He talks like he's all grown up, but he's still a kid. He inside. ate his son. With your love of Ferris wheels, I'd say you're still a kid on the inside too. He's his own son. <laughs> you got a point there. Oh, shit. You're probably right. <clears throat> yeah, I think I th maybe you're right. About he's Shoma. right in the middle of his rebellious stage, so he's been a handful. His mother hasn't been around for about three years now. She was killed in the Cyclops killing. Was it a divorce? <laughs> yeah. She got sick of me and left the house. Yeah, I'm sick of you too, bro. I'm about to jump Does off the top of the first wheel. the Yakuza by any chance? <laughs> what? Where in the nice. World Imagine we didn't know from? this info. Just something I heard. That you have gang connections. You got gang ties? <laughs> <laughs> That's complete nonsense. I'm just an ordinary comedian. Well, even if it was true, he wouldn't just admit it. Yeah, he's sweating bullets. Yeah, we. I mean, we didn't need the. Uh, you know, I'm a the thermal now. But mm -hmm. when I was in my early twenties, I was working as a regular company employee. How old are you I now? I appeared on several quiz shows on the side and ended up winning first place many times. Komeji was famous as a quiz king ever since he was yeah, look how big his brain is. He even had worshippers who lauded him as the quiz god. Thinking back, that may have been um, the peak of my life. He's one of the contestants Lord, in Jeopardy. I went, everyone <laughs> buying me all sorts of things. Maybe I shouldn't have taken advantage of the situation like I did. I was so enamored by the glamorous celebrity life. I've always loved comedy, so I strived to become a comedian. But after that, well... It's just as you saw on that stage. I wonder why there wasn't an audience. It was so funny. Mm. God. Mm. Uh, I haven't told you yet, have I? The producer for that show knew about me from my Quiz King days. Ah, right. He thought I could tell all sorts of antidotes and gave my, me an Sorry offer. Sorry for calling you Team Popo back then. Oh, okay. It so was in the script. Didn't really have a choice. They, they are the police. Oh my God. Yeah. By the way, Iris and Mizuki are called Team Lemniscate, and Momo and Chinpei were called Team Yakuza. You're close. Oh, this? It's my one and only stage outfit. This sharp little bow tie is the highlight. My boy bought it for me last year. Your boy's dead, bro. Bow ties you are bought it for yourself? unusual. <laughs> Traditional ties are more common. But you... Oh, uh, I wasn't. I tend to take it off or put mm. it on based on how I'm feeling. Hmm. You feeling? Do you come to the stage a lot? Yeah, you come here to remember your son. The Nissan department store took a liking to me. He's given me the opportunity to appear several times now. I'm sorry. I have no idea what happened. I was just invited there and hosted the show as requested. Then that body suddenly appeared. That body. Did you know Jin, the victim? <laughs> I've never met him. I do know he was hated for his extreme narcissism and ego. Mm -hmm. If I had to guess, the motive was probably a grudge. Someone must have had a grudge against him and did that. We went around the Ferris wheel twice already? Bro, we're done. Think so. It ah, smells like alcohol. Does it? A little. A lot. It's more like Komeji's blood alcohol level is 0.12%. I just couldn't get over what happened last night and ended up drinking too much. I wanted to forget about everything. So here I am asking you questions about it. So you can remember, you fuck. So we're done with the days of asking people stuff. Okay. But what the fuck comes next? We gotta go back to Abyss? I Sorry hate you. I couldn't help, Mr. Ryu. Yeah, you're useless. Luck with the investigation. Now, if you'll excuse me. Don't tell a joke. Don't tell a joke, please. Oh. Please, please. Oh, thank God. Is that Shoko? No, I'm just kidding. They have no faces.
I'm just I'm just trying to you know maybe there's something. Okay. All right. What the fuck is that? Oh, HQ. All right. Okay. How much time do you got left? Uh, I mean, how close are we to the hour? I like 45. Okay. So, I mean, we can wrap up this moment we, we, here. Yeah, like the let's do it. Are going back to Abyss? Yeah. I want to reorganize the information I have so far. Then, why don't yeah. you just do it in this limousine? Oh, right. I guess I could. Oh, this this dude living lavish. This limo looks just like, it's, it's, especially with Thomas sitting there, looks just like the limo that um, Igor would sit in in the Persona games. Mm. Like the exact same setup. What was that? Is that Bailey's? <laughs> <laughs> is that Jaeger? That is. I think so. That, yeah, is that, that is. What the fuck? And then that's uh, fuck. What's that green bottle? Fuck. I I don't remember. Whatever. Lady. Roar like a vicious beast. Recite the sutras, like the Karma Sutra? Essence of the Sutra of Great Wisdom, which permits us to go further. The Bodhisattva of the True Freedom, through the deep practice of the Great Wisdom. That's not what I wanted to do. Oh, Sariputra, phenomena are no different to emptiness. Emptiness is no different. I should have done Roar like a lion. <laughs> this incomparable <laughs> mantra tells us on, he kept on, going together <laughs> Jesus Christ to the shore of Satori Shut up! Stop shouting! But you surprised me I thought that the ghost of an s &M pervert with a police uniform fetish who died in a tanning booth had come to haunt me Haven't I showed <laughs> you this body many times over the past six months? I'm still not used to it Your body is semi-transparent and I can only see Yeah, we know so, this part why did you come out? To reorganize. easier to talk to you this way. About the reason... Isn't that what you're investigating for? Yeah, but... Remember what Mr. Date and Iris said? For some reason, just the right half, I could travel through time and space. Maybe that body teleported here from some other world. The other half could have been absorbed into some other dimension. And that's with the body in two. Don't tell me you believe that. No, just for some reason it's stuck in my head. What do you think of this car? Honestly, it reeks of bad taste. Makes me want to puke just looking at it. Keep talking like that, and I'll throw you out the window. Then you'd be a goner too. I'm the one driving this car, you know. Why don't you take the leap and buy a different car? What? I can't. This car is all I have of my parents. The car Your parents passed away, the car didn't they? Yeah, in an airplane crash when I was young. From then on, I was living with my younger brother. <laughs> but six years ago, he also. Six years ago, your younger brother. Everything is six years ago. What the fuck? Six years ago, back when the... When we arrested everybody? Come on, bro. What is happening? There isn't much Stupid. useful information to sort out in the first place. If I had to say one thing, it would be the view cube video in that QR code link. By the way, I'm going to cut down on the word salad and call it QR video from now on. The what, teeny bit of information we got from that QR video I mean, is pretty much all we have. I you don't know? I think it was about half a year ago, a video similar to that one went viral. Mm -hmm. The mysterious video. Batch forty nine. Yeah, four ninety. Whatever. The code reveals this. Everyone uh -huh. who visits that place. So let's see the fucking video. Us. We all left behind the same message. I learned the secret of the hey, world. Tama, mm -hmm. is Batch four ninety still up anywhere on the internet? I looked it up. Here it is. Okay, here we go. Glasses on. Castlevania, bro. Okay. the I got anal. Okay. Cloning. Rip me, burn me. That's the. That's how the guy died. He got ripped in half, and then he exploded in fire. Mm-hmm. What date was that? That was a date.
Mm. Okay. Mm. I, I feel like no if we could see the dates more. Well, you know, Rift and Bernie could mean. Because you just said cloning, right? Yeah. Why did you say cloning? Uh, that sequence where they're showing the same person over and over again. So, I didn't even think of it like that, but when you said cloning, and then I saw rip me, burn me, mm -hmm. like, back when I, you know, when we were all kids and you would, like, you know, burn, like, songs onto, like, a CD. Oh, And yeah. you would also call that, like, ripping, ripping yeah, too. yeah, ripping yeah. and burning, yeah, you're right. But ripping and burning has, like, a double entendre here. Right, like, not copy and paste, kind of, like, copy and duplicate. Co exactly. It could, huh. it may not just be split and then burn the body, like, in the literal right, sense. Yeah. That's what I'm going with. That's I think I with. think you're right with that because it's it it was on a computer too, so it could be like data, mm -hmm. like mm -hmm. take my consciousness out of my body, put it in another body. Yes. And since he's cloning, I because I assume he's cloning that because with Jin being split in half, if you say it's time travel, sure that makes sense, but the fact that the hours of when they died can't change. You can't say right. he died midnight. And then he died, uh, like midnight in the future. He died, mm -hmm. you know. But then he dies uh, forty hours ahead of time in the past. Um, and as much as this game does weird stuff in terms of like deviating from what we can do in reality, I don't think time travel is what the fuck they do. I think time travel is what they're gonna use as their uh, red herring, kind of like how Nyes and all that shit was the red herring in the last game. But yep. the reality was mind swapping, uh, and I think in this, I think cloning is still a viable option, because uh, it's all about moving the consciousness and what is real and all that shit. Like what is, makes a person real, all this shit. So I think that could be. I think yeah. you're right. Okay. Well, YouTube, we just solved the fucking case. So <laughs> we did. We did. I hope. I hope you guys enjoyed all three That's parts it. of this series. We fucking did it. We finished it's it over. early this time. Look at that. We're smarter now. We're smarter than we were the last time. You know, at 8.80 a.m. Uh, That's right. But let's keep going. <laughs> I, I like where we're going with that, though. I do like where we're going with that. Tama's sitting on the seat, so it seems... Oh, my bad. Same as the QR video. It was originally uploaded to ViewQ. The account holder is unknown. In any case, Bats 490 is the only lead we have right now. If we can figure it out, maybe it'll lead to the QR video. <laughs> Okay. Ryuki, you have a call. It's from Mizuki. Mizuki? She's gonna start screaming. I'm connecting her. It's her from the future. <laughs> Kizuni's dead! Oh, Ryuki? I got your number four. <clears throat> what is it? I remembered something about Bats 490. I thought maybe it could lead to a clue. What did you remember? Someone in my class at school actually figured it out. He decoded the hidden message in Bats 490. He did? His name is Shoma Enda. He might know something, so Which, I would go That's his son. Team. Anyway, see ya. That's fucking Blockhead's son. Oh shit. Shoma. Isn't that? Andy's Komeji's. Ooh, that's a nice place to stop. <laughs> that is. Okay. Oh fuck. Okay. Uh. Shit. So they're saying that he has he has the inside scoop? I got like a work text at yeah, the yeah. worst time. So, okay. so uh, that's awesome. Shoma, Shoma figured it out. That's what they're saying. Or fuck. he's... Like, claiming to have figured it out. Yeah. Shoma. He looked like Ota. You know what happened last night. <laughs> All right. All right. Let, so for YouTube, uh, that's the end of part three. I think we, we made good headway with deciphering what the video is about. I think so too. I think you're right with I the rip so. and burn. Because the literal sense and the actual digital sense, it makes sense. Rip and burn like yeah. a fucking CD. They're ripping who you are out of you and putting it onto a new body. And splitting a body in half would make sense if like... Maybe that's a part of the process for them, or it's just, uh... Or it could just be their way of, like, sending a message, right? Because once be they clone, you don't need both bodies. Right. So if you're being, like, a, like, a, like I don't know, a terrorist or, like, someone right. that's trying to strike fear into the hearts of humanity, like, yeah, that's a, that is quite the message to, to send. Right. Like, it just feels like a terrorist thing because it's, like, super cryptic. You cut a body in half, you leave half of the carcass there, then you put a fucking picket sign right. with a QR code on it. Like, Yeah, it, and it... 
and like yeah the the message on the QR code uh fight for fight to be free or something like that I don't know maybe yeah. we could go even crazier right we could uh, he's an IT company but he also has music food but I, I feel like music food is not what's important maybe maybe it also has something to do with AI in a way where okay he they know like he's creating clones maybe for medical reasons he needed another body uh, and a more important a better version of his own body maybe longevity yeah. something like that synthetic well it's not synthetic it was real uh because the organs and everything um so maybe that's why he started getting into cloning and then uh, he needed to split his body with the new parts or some shit i don't know whatever but then maybe yeah. there's other people that could benefit from it like maybe ai's wanted to be free i don't know i don't know if ai is important to that at all i think the fact that i'm thinking of trying to tell detective and how, how uh, the, <laughs> the, favorite evil, game. Yeah, the evil AI, uh, the common trope in a lot of future sci-fi shit. I, I don't want to deviate too far and go crazy into theories, but I do think we're kind of headed in the right direction. Um, I think so, too. I think I maybe think so cloning and, and the, the rip and tear, be, I mean, rip and burn being like a CD. I think, I think, I think, we, yo, bra Cindy. We in here, baby. We in there. We in there. We in there. <laughs> and you, you know what? You know what's... You know what we gotta do? Hold on, hold on. Boom. Fuck. Why did it do it twice? Whatever. Whatever. Fuck it. There's two. Because <laughs> we in there. That's how integrated we are. We were we shocked, there, and now That's we it. are the characters. There we go. All right. Uh, That's right. Thank you guys for watching part three. Uh, hope you guys enjoyed. Hope you... You know, if... If you know about the game, don't spoil it. We're, we're playing this like it kind of like recently after the game launched. It's gonna take us some time to beat us. Beat us? What? <laughs> beat it? <laughs> oh, whoa! <laughs> we want all the smoke. <laughs> Try to beat us. But yo, you can't. yo, where, where? What's his name? Genny? Where he Genny. at, bro? I'll, I'll fuck him up. Getty? The Gettysburg <laughs> Address? What? <laughs> well, it's like Gen G E N or Genny. Well, the polar bear. Fuck. All right. Yeah. <laughs> Fuck that guy. Uh, yeah. No. We. If if you know stuff, please don't spoil it. But if yeah. uh, if you don't know anything, feel free to let us know your theories. But don't don't do that thing where it's like, oh, I think it might be this, and it's one hundred. It's like one to one exactly what the fucking thing yeah. is. All right. You son of exactly. a bitch. Exactly. All right. No. But uh, hopefully you guys enjoyed, um, and we'll see you guys in part four. But until then, peace. Peace.